Today was the first day back at class for students at Citronelle High School following the death of a fellow student. Friday afternoon, 14-year-old Anna Weaver died in an ATV crash. News 5's Chad Petrie shows you how students and staff honored her memory. The big crowd that gathered in front of the flagpole to pray Monday morning is a living testament to the life of Anna Weaver. You can see how many lives she impacted. And everybody here today has been touched by Anna Weaver. They describe her as a bright, thoughtful young woman who lit up the room. You know, we love Anna. Uh, we're going to miss her. But she's with Jesus. And we know she's in a better place. And we'll be fine. And, uh, you know... It's just going to be a big, big loss for us, and, and, and it's going to take some time to heal. But, uh, but, but we're strong, and we'll move on, and Anna would certainly want us to move on. So, and uh, and keep, uh, you know, keep thinking positives. Faculty here say Anna Weaver had a strong faith and was always thinking of others. One of the last text messages that Anna sent to me, you know, she was concerned about uh, one of her friends and was asking for prayer for one of her friends and and how to you know talk to him of, about the Lord in addition to the prayer Monday morning one we love you Anna students also led a balloon release on the football practice field in Citronelle Chad Petrie WKRG News 5 a 13 year old girl was also hurt in Friday's accident she has since gone home from the hospital